Yo, Chop Cheese was good. We're back. <laughs> Swigs, Jigs, and Goose. Where we are, Jig? Ew. Where we at? We in the dungeon. Goose, you got something to say? Your favorite hood opinion piece right. back at your fucking throat. Yo, we gonna go straight into it. Straight into it. All right? Cuba, we with you. Cuba. All right? Fuck America. <laughs> Oh, well, what? fuck Biden's America. Dude. Yo. Ain't it ironic Cuba. that not so long ago, motherfuckers just like, come here, come here. We got the doors open. And they just shit it on. And then as soon as they get some possible Republicans maybe wanting to come over here, <laughs> escaping communism, <laughs> that nah, don't come. Man, those poor Cuban people. You know what's the funniest shit is that people blaming America for everything that they going through? When in reality, these motherfuckers been communists for years. That's the reason we don't want to trade with them. Yeah, that's been happening for years. So they've been fucked. Like, it's, bro, that shit so is crazy, it, bro. Are you saying like, um, so they're letting in all the people from the southern from border, Mexico, <laughs> but not letting people in <laughs> from Cuba? The people who really need asylum, the people who are s- s- escaping communism, yeah, bro. the people who really need help. Not people who are saying, ¿Tiene trabajo? Uh, We're talking about people that are like, yo, we ain't got water, we ain't got fresh food, we ain't got meat, we ain't got gasoline, we have no quality of life. We need something help. We need some help. Yo, but do they work hard? They can't work hard because it's a communism. Question, question. Did you see Turning Point USA go over there? That, that was too dark. That's, That's old. an old one. You know, and they it just, just recently they popped pub- back up. They published it as a new video, but I've seen that a long time ago. Bro, you know what's the craziest shit ever? That the, nobody in the media is touching the word, the C word, bro. Communism. Of course they, not. They, they're, they're telling Cunt. you it's exactly. Did, did you see Circle Back? Bro, Circle Back Sack. Back sack. She did not want to touch that. Bro, nobody's even using that word. They all saying they're all saying uh, you know, uh, COVID and they need medicine and food. They're refusing to uh, acknowledge the fact that this society's been fucked because they've been communists and ruled by Castro for the last 40 years until he fucking finally died. You guys want to say? You want to say something? They uh, she's in a heat for other stuff too, but we're going to continue with that in a little bit. We can keep See, going with the, the Cuba thing. The, the funny thing is Circle remember back sack. Cuba used to was once a prosper land where they had full potential, and wh- why it was it was governed under how long ago was that? I mean, we're talking about what the sixties. It, it was all until Castro uh, took over, and once they transformed to communism, as you can see, what happened? Bro. No infrastructure. You don't come here for the facts. I mean, you don't. You you can go you and Google it yourself, facts. and you yeah, can yeah, see yeah. everything. But communism see, sucks, y'all. Matter of fact, go randomly if you have a Cuban neighbor or Cuban friend or someone that you know, speak to them and educate yourself because yeah. what they're gonna tell you is highly different from what the media is yeah, telling. They're not with that shit, no, bro. And no. the media tries to demonize them. They're not with that shit, bro. And to even go further. A lot of people who live in islands surrounding Cuba, Puerto Rico, Jamaica, Dominican Republic, these people are people who fled Cuba. A lot of them are Bro, refugees. True. So you know, told, let's say how far, it's funny that my grandfather's Cuban. Mira eso. And did he flee I didn't Cuba know that. or did he just go willingly? My, you well, look Cuban. Well, my grand, no, no, no. Well, my grandmother <laughs> Cuban remarried. Cuban B. She remarried. But Cuban my grandfather B. in Puerto Rico is Cuban. <laughs> That's fire. He's Cuban. Well, this, yeah. is, this is in even, his 90s and walks around like a like a G like a swift 60 year old <laughs> I can still fight like a, well listen to this the the head of the Homeland Security here in America is is he's Cuban mm. his parents are descended from Cuba and they mm. fled Cuba he don't fuck with that communism shit or, or is he the funny thing is now he's on TV telling people do not come here yeah it's the so, truth you shitting on everybody's, you shitting on all the people who tried and went through the channels and took years and years upon years and studying to be actual citizens, bro. But listen to this. There's actual bro, asylum every cases. Every country has borders, bro. There's actual cases. And if you have one legitimate, it definitely is someone who's trying to flee an environment like Cuba. Yeah. But the hypocrisy yeah. that I'm trying to point out is his family didn't go through those channels. They came here illegally. Yes. We can't say that they're not going through crazy shit down, like coming through the Mexican border. That oh, cartel's no, 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 no. real, yeah, bro. Of like, yeah, of course. The those, coyotes. Yeah, the coyotes are real, <laughs> but bro. Remember, like, coyotes. But you know what's crazy about... I, I think the struggle is real, right, on both ends. But how do you allow people to come through the south through Mexico, right? Walk through and climb over a wall, right? But In droves. You don't allow In these... Droves. these Cubans that are swimming in shark infested water to Florida <laughs> Bendito, or, or, or Bendito you try, and you tell them to go back after they made it 
Most of them don't even make it. How about the hypocrisy of this? Biden took out that uh, catch and release, is it? Where they catch you, but then you got to wait in Mexico. in Mexico. No, yeah, you can they, stay here now, right? Yeah, yeah no, yeah. but they, You're released into the they public. took, they, he removed that. Mm-hmm. And now those people who made that treacherous journey after you survived, they kicking them right out. So can I ask you this question? The same journey that they're telling the Cubans not to take because they could possibly obviously die is not the same journey that the people were making from Chile from um, all of these South countries. American countries. No, you just said it. They, they're going the wrong route. If they go around through Mexico, then they'll <laughs> they're get They're good. In. So that's yeah. what it is. Then they'll get Cubans, in. go Change. through Mexico. Go through Mexico. <laughs> if you want to Mexican, asylum. you good, yo. Go through Mexico. Damn. You good. That's go. how... Caravan, remember that. Caravan. Caravan. But, damn, that's it. Damn. Not the dodge. Hypocrisy there is horrible. The Hypocrisy. Fuck, though, like, how about the funny shit is that... How many flags... You seen the American flag... Yeah, in that, Cuba, everyone loves the American make flag, American but Americans. <laughs> Isn't that like crazy, that. bro? Hong Kong, Cuba. Two years ago. Yeah. Okay. Cuba. Think about that, chopped cheese. Think about that, because now the media is telling you that our flag it, it incites violence and it's a rate. You're an inherent racist and all that shit. If you want to fly an American flag, get but the fuck out of here, bro. You do know that there's That's a crazy. There's across a, the world, their stance for freedom is our flag what's right is wrong what's wrong is gonna be right that shit is nuts bro but weird there's, times. there's a surrounding island that is actually looking for the same thing Cuba's looking for which is Haiti at the very moment right now oh my they're, god they're, now we're gonna switch to Haiti let's talk about Haiti let's Haiti, do this Haiti is trying their best to to make matters you know whatever they they're have they're trying to quell that storm because of what they just went through bro now it's just right? even worse if you can see yeah, I, I could mean, imagine Jigs, you brought this up in, a, in the group chat about yep. How many presidents now three have countries, been assassinated? Three countries, Tanzania, no, it's Tanzania, Burundi, is it Burundi, right, or something like that? And then it's um, Burundi, Burundi. And obviously Haiti. And like Haiti. Yeah. All three countries decided presidents. not to vaccinate their people. All three presidents died. But that, that is, a, true. is that a coincidence? You don't come here for the facts, Chop Cheese. He's that, not a doctor. I'm, I'm not a scientist. Saying, I'm just saying what happened. I'm not saying that there's any conspiracy theory behind it. I'm just saying That's what just happened. Fact. And would that be considered, you think, a conspiracy since what you stated about the vaccines? Or in your mind, you think that that's a little bit more directed to just control? Oh, they're dead. Yeah, they were killed. They're Definitely. dead. But killed for their rejection of the vaccine? Oh, I didn't or say that. Oh, I know, no, 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 no. I'm saying, what do you think, though? Because um, I, I think that potentially anyone who goes against big government, CDC, whatever you want to call it, the who. <laughs> the who? I, I think they were in the wrong Can't we place. Say it? I guess yeah, at I the can't wrong. Who are we talking about? What you mean? And anything that goes against the grain. That's it. So, do you think that potentially they? How about this? The, yeah. how, sorry, sorry. No, okay, okay. How about the craziest coincidence of all of this is that the after these so-called assassins were found out who they were, they happened to be Cubans with like CIA military Colombians. backgrounds. Was it Colombians? Yeah. Excuse me. Some you don't come here for the it. facts. No, I think I remember but, but hearing with Columbia. American ties too. Like some, I heard someone snitches for the CIA, all this crazy shit. We're gonna start, yo. The CIA from now on is the CIA. But that Sia. go, Sia. that just. I, I like her music. I love her music. She's gonna ruin Sia. That comes from <laughs> everything though, because as you can see, Kia. everything is related. Kia, because Kia. the same Kia. way potentially these presidents could have been assassinated for refusing any type of vaccines in the country. Remember the way yeah, that they're yeah, gonna. But I didn't. I didn't say that. I know you didn't. We're making that clear. No, I'm making this. I'm the assassinated. I'm, <laughs> a man was shot across the street from me. Yo, yesterday. seen that shit, bro? He, he refused wasn't the by, vaccine. Wasn't by the cops. They knocked on his door. <laughs> it wasn't by a white supremacist either. Well, put, look at that shit. What I'm trying to say is, I'm just saying I could get assassinated. They're controlling. I want the smoke. information so much, and the way they control it is by saying it's all misinformation. Everything. So. It Everything. goes along the lines with now they don't want you to see why these presidents are refusing the vaccine. They just want you to focus on misinformation is causing people to get COVID again. Am I wrong in saying that it was the Tanzanian president that sent the fruit fly sample? No, no, he no, no, they sent a fruit back. Uh, they yeah, tested yeah. a mango they or some uh, shit. It was and the, an animal. The yeah, that was the 100%. shit that was flowing around online. No, it was 100 percent. It was the yeah, same was one. Same one. That's crazy, It was man. two fruits and an animal, if I'm not mistaken, and they were all tested positive Jesus for COVID, Christ. for Fifi, excuse me. Fifi, Fifi. Oh, Fifi, yeah. Fifi, Fifi, Fifi. I'm going to fact check myself right now. No, it's, it, that's right. It's pretty, it's pretty it? nuts. No, I remember for, um...